Hey guys, here's a new fan. This is a 10 inch Kenmore 537 dot um, 8070. So, um, got this this weekend. I didn't make a video of it yet because um, I was busy these last couple days. Um, <clears throat> here it is. I have my flashlight on because this area is so dark. Um, and that light's a Tiffany style light, so it has like an orange hue and it doesn't really work. So I'm using my phone flashlight. Here it is. It's brown. Brown everywhere. Would say Kenmore there, but I, um, got faded. I also like that little part right there. That matches the screw-in thing down there. To like tilt it. Um, now also put a new plug on it. Um, because the other one, the original one, it was just all dangerous. It was like this. It was this kind. Um, and I replaced it because, well, first of all, it's dangerous like that. Um, and also it's kind of cracking at spots. I'm keeping it because it just looks cool on like how the how the design looks. And so put a new plug on it. And this one to the GE I'm gonna replace as well. At some point I haven't got around to doing it. Because that has the same style and it's kinda dangerous looking like this. So whenever I get the time I'll do that. Anyways, here it is. I think this might be from the 70s? 1971? That's just my guess. That's what I call it. But, um... So, there's only a couple problems with this fan. First of all, if you notice, it's not... It's not straight. And, um, the oscillator doesn't work. Um, because that thing right there, poking out right there, that's for the oscillator. Um, and I believe the arm inside of it, from the gear, from there, to the, um, base right here, is disconnected. I would have to take this whole entire cover off. And it's also cracked some spots. I think it's on the other side, but it's cracked. This is just big light, which is the old school plastic. So that's what I call it. But um, bearings are really good. Um, it didn't oil them or anything. So it's that. So there's that problem with the um, oscillator and the uh, os um, and the cracking in the motor housing. Anyways, just single speed push button, start on low. And it vibrates this whole entire table. Single speed. Vibrates this. Works good though. It's just stuck in that position though. And I'm just about to go to the store and um, get Halloween decorations for the fans here, like all around here. Um, and I'm going to decorate them, put like some, I'm going to put like fake cobwebs and stuff like that on them, which is going to look kind of cool. Um, but I'll make a video of, um, of them. Whenever I get all the stuff and they're all decorated down, I'll make a video. Since I love Halloween, I think it would be a cool thing. See the coils. Runs pretty good. It just vibrates the whole entire table. 
Well, the TV stand, so. Uh, sometimes I'm just not like put pressing it behind blades. Sometimes it scares me, but still with that. But. <clears throat> Leave the light on. But, um, so yeah, that is a 10 inch Kenmore 537.8070. So yeah, that's it. Bye.